Cardano to have a massive breakout in 2019. Welcome back guys, it's Crypto Rocco from Rockstar Trading Channel guys and in today's video I'll be going in depth about Cardano. So I'll be talking to you about trading Cardano in the shorter time frame and how I'm trading it. Also guys I'll talk about investing in Cardano and for a longer term play. So a few people messaged me about Cardano having a massive breakout. So guys it is actually looking good. You can see it's very very oversold. I was looking to buy it here as you can see. I made a video about it that had a nice little pump as you can see I traded this in the group it was a nice I did it in the free Facebook group it was a nice 10% gain but it wasn't a, as big a move as I would have liked you can see it tried to get above that line it couldn't get above it uh, previously guys I made another video on Cardano uh, to have a massive breakout it, that was I think four or five months ago and that worked out really well. I think it was this video, Cardano to have a massive breakout. That worked out really well. This was it was this um where was this? It was this head and shoulders pattern uh, back in uh, back in March that worked really well. So I'm looking at it again, see what Cardano can do now. So at the moment, guys, you can be doing short term trading. I've started a new group. I don't know if people know um, where I'm producing educational content as you can see uh, I made the first video and this is more of a not a signals group I, I am produce, providing what I'm looking to trade but I don't want to turn it into a signals group I want it more of an educational group so I bought Ada uh, here guys with the group at 460 uh, what was my target so I bought it at 460 let's have a look so shorter time frame so longer time frame so let's come back to the video I'll talk about how I'm trading in a bit uh, longer term guys it needs to get above this zone if it can get above the red moving average and this uh, Fibonacci level that I've got here and it's a massive uh, support and resistance zone if it can get above it if it does something like this then yes you could look to be trading I'll be sharing with you the dollar chart as well this is Cardano against Bitcoin then you could you know look for a longer term uh, trade or invest uh, investment in Cardano see if it can stay above it and we have a massive breakout but guys in the shorter time frame I wouldn't just buy and hold because you could easily we've seen it happen it tried to get above it fail tried to get above it fail we've seen it happen so many times it can happen again so shorter time frame what you can do is buy uh, wait for a setup so I use my setup to buy um, let's have a look where I bought it so I, I use my setup to buy at the 460 level so this was the zone that I bought it at let's go into a shorter time frame so using my strategy guys I bought it when I saw this moving up you can see my indicator going up and it was my perfect strategy to get uh, get in here and this has been a nice little trade uh, the first first target has been hit so about 470 uh, 478 was my first target and 500 is the next zone so I'll see I mean it's almost hit my second target as well so that is how I'm looking to trade Cardano short term and um, if you're trading short term guys if you're in this trade you might want to take some profits around around this level uh, and if you're looking for investing guys I wouldn't say it's all out by Cardano at the moment if it can get above it yes it can have a massive breakout so that's my thoughts on Cardano trading and investing I'm going to share with you my dollar chart as well that's why I wanted to make this video because it is looking like it is in a good zone from an Elliott wave point of view I don't know if people use Elliott waves um, again it's, it's not something I'm teaching just now I'm, I'm trying to teach a simple strategy that works in the group where you can find the signals and um, if you're interested guys you can email me below I'll leave some links below if you're interested from an Elliott point of view is this is looking like a five waves up and maybe a correction and it's also the 786 level and also guys if on the daily guys you can see the price does not want to go below this zone so if it's a, this is another zone so that I talked talk to other zone in Bitcoin if we can get above this red line and stay above this zone then yes we can have some nice big targets some targets I'll be looking for so this will be kind of the first resistance zone so these are the two zones I'll be looking for to take profits if you're looking for a longer term trade and guys if it's a full-on altcoin season again I'm not saying it will uh, there are some I'll make a really important video in the next couple of days. So make sure you subscribe and turn on the notification button. You don't have to take my course. I mean, I don't take, uh, teach courses, but you don't have to join my group. Uh, all I ask from you guys is watch my videos. If you just watch my videos, it really means a lot to me. And if you want to support me, it does take a lot of time for me to provide this content. I'd really appreciate if you just like, subscribe and turn on the notification button. That will mean a lot to me. If you want to take your trading to the next level, you can look at this group. It's only quite cheap, $9.99. So guys, 
let's have a look so if cardano can bounce from here this is a good zone where it can have a reversal we've not really seen this from cardano uh, as much before last time we saw it we had a massive rally back in 2018 that rally was almost 200 percent so at the moment guys you can see it's forming higher highs and higher lows again i'm not saying it's an all-out massive bull move i'm going to make that video but you can see a lot of the altcoins are running it could be a short-term move like we've seen before and it falls down or it this could be the main massive move if it is the massive move if it can stay above these zones uh, the first target i would have is sort of this 236 level which you can see has been resistance previously and if we can get a break above that then we can aim these massive targets that we've got i'll stay i'll keep you guys up to date with how i'm trading it short term guys i've already shared with you how i'm trading longer term i've talked about some of the zones news wise there's not too much news i know there are some news on shelly uh, cardano is a coin that likes to move these are some of the coins i keep on my watch list they like to move matic is a coin again i didn't hold matic as much um, i know someone did uh, i didn't hold as much i wish i did uh, uh, raven coin is a coin that uh that i did trade i think uh, where did i get in rave yeah raven coin was a nice trade that i took um so yeah there's there's lots of old coins performing well but do take profits um because you never know if it's going to be a massive move or if it's going to be another move and it go down so thank you very much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed it if you have enjoyed it smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button my question to you guys is what are your thoughts on ada cardano do you think it will have a massive move up or do you think this is just a short-term move and it's going to keep going down comment below guys and let's have a discussion thank you very much smash that like button subscribe to my channel turn on the notification button email me below or if you're interested in the group you can email me or i'll leave some links below for you thank you very much and i'll see you guys soon with another great video go cardano